Welcome. This is the weekly reading for the fourth week of September. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, on the 22nd, um, the Virgos, uh, that is the end of the Virgo season, okay? So that is the first three days. So Virgos, uh, the first three days, the Virgo season is going to be over. So... 2021 20, and 22. 2021 20, and 22. So, your year is the year of the lovers. And uh, if you're looking for a relationship, it is going to be good. It is the time for a relationship. Um, it is going to be absolutely fabulous. So, Virgos, you end here. So, this is the last for the Virgo season. And then the Libra season begins here. So, Librans, you're beginning um, the year with the energy of, uh, um, you Librans are beginning the year with the energy of uh, the Magician, okay? So, let's see. So, Virgo, you're ending the year with love. Um, some sort of an issue and situation is going to be coming up. Um, some sort of a money, a judgment call, some information is coming out. Um, coming out about a um, situation you have no regrets a situation to do with a Aquarian Gemini or Libran you're not going to have any regrets I see truths light is being shed on two people that have done some sort of an injustice so you men you Virgo men um, be aware that whatever if you have a relationship if you are seeing someone I see light is going to be shed on you and this person and some sort of a discrepancy that has come up, okay? Then um, we see a new start. Um, it's going to be coming up for a lot of you Virgos. So um, you're ending and you're going in this period and this year where a new start is going to be coming up for a lot of you Virgos. Now you men 50 years and older, there seems to be some sort of a regrets that you have uh, with a past situation that has to do with an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran. So, um, you Virgos is a month, is a year of love, and you're dealing uh, with some sort of a relationship problems. Um, so, Virgos, be aware of this. Um, you can see this energy that is coming up, and it has to do with money and some sort of a conflicts, and it has to do with a whole lot of money. So, be aware of this. Then as we look at the Librans, I see the worries is going to be over. Some sort of a, a successful um, a situation is going to be transpiring. Some of you who have kids, a lot of worries about the kids. So I see a lot of you Librans worrying about the kids. So be aware. I see love is going to be offered. A cycle is going to be over. A new cycle is going to be getting with a corporation institution. They have seen the truth of some sort of a... Um, situation conflicts that was going on i see some of you are going to be having conflicts with your kids whatever is coming up some sort of information is coming up that is going to bring uh, some sort of a conflicts with your kids so be aware of this then we see the energy of the magician overcoming some sort of a situation with the devil if you notice the energy of the devil has to do um, with some sort of a money situation, okay? And some of you, Libran, have to repay some money. Whatever is happening in Trans Bar, I see some of you, Librans, have to repay some money. So, when we look in the cross, and it is really, it ends up, you can see the Librans different from the Virgos. Um, the cross is that some sort of a magician, um, um, uh, some sort of a, um, issue, situation is going to be coming up. That is going to be showing up for some sort of a fast resolution with people who are having kids or people who are in some sort of a relationship and there's some sort of a conflict. There's going to be some sort of a fast resolution that is going to be coming in. Um, I see truth is going to be coming up for you, Virgo, so be aware of this. Um, and then I see... Um, some sort of a situation that a scorpion had created for some of you Libran, I see that um, you're going to be overcoming this, okay? Um, because if you notice, the worries is going to be over with a corporation, institution, and some money. 
a bank, a financial institution, they're seeing the truth of what is transpiring. And then some sort of a um, cycle is going to be over a new resolution to some sort of a false height with a whole lot of money is going to be ending. So be aware of this. So it is a year where I see light is going to be shedding on um, things that some of you were not aware of. A new star is going to be coming in, especially for you Virgos. Um, then we look at the Librans and we see a cyclist over with a corporation institution, a very deceptive uh, corporation institution it could be a false corporation institution and um, what we see is that moving forward I see overcoming the worries is going to be over and um, they're going to be finding out something about a cancer and a whole lot of money um, I see a lot of um, situation with kids a lot of situation that is coming up with kids and your young liberals so be aware of this all right so um we are going to be looking at uh, um, what is coming up for each and every individual person. So, so for the people who were born on the 20th, there is some sort of information that is going to be coming out about a whole lot of money and a Libran. Whoever this Libran is, whatever is happening and transpiring, they're going to be finding out that a Libran um, somehow has, has confiscated a whole lot of money. Here is the energy, and this can be an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran. I'm sorry, an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran. They're going to be finding out, and some sort of information is going to be, light is going to be shedding, and people are going to be finding out some sort of information where a whole lot of money was being um, um, took by someone else. Someone else could have created some sort of a way in order to access and receive money in a false way and i see that you virgos could be finding out about this and could be um bringing it out and letting people know or people could be doing it for you virgos so it's vice versa however this is going to be transparent some of you virgos could be um a lot of money could be returning to you and this is going to be good so whatever and however this is coming up and transpiring uh, you virgos a lot of money could be returning to you that you were not aware of okay so it could be a divorce it could be the, the sales of a house however this is happening and transpiring a whole lot of money is going to be coming back to you then i see some sort of a judgment call um judgment call um for the people who were born on the 21st so um this judgment call is going to be yeah you know it is it is what it is is nothing for you to worry about if a partner says they're leaving you're like okay it is what it is if uh, um that is what you feel to do go ahead i can't stop you it is what it is and i see that this is going to bring some of you some sort of an inner peace so people who were born on the 21st of september it's going to be okay it's going to be all right if this is how it should be then you know i can't make any changes i can't um, um make you change your mind it is good i understand our karma is over that's okay so i see you virgos are going to be taking it very very okay fine all right so that cycle is over and that is very good in the way that you're going to be looking at it and the way you're going to be dealing with these issues and situation that is going to be coming up so whatever the issue is between you and a friend or a family member i see um you're going to be okay fine uh, i you know um i'm glad you um you know could let me know how you feel and how things were instead of i'm sitting here not knowing so this is going to be good so it's a year where um, relationships could be ending friendships could be ending but it's going to be okay um because um what is going to be happening and transpiring is that uh, you're going to be realizing that um um there's no problem you understand you are uh, being aligned with the energies of what is happening and transpiring when we look at the people who are born on the 22nd and the last day of the Virgo season, you are going to be having a new start. Some new information is going to be coming in for the women, men, um, and the young men, uh, older men, some sort of a 
issues could be coming up could be cracking up so be aware of this um so however this is happening and transpiring men 50 years and older there could be some sort of a regret holding on to the past not moving forward in the future so be aware of this because it's definitely going to be coming up it's the last of the virgo season and i see a whole lot of new story for women and younger men older men you are holding on to the past you need to let go of the past and move forward by holding on on the past you can't um regain balance in your life okay and you just need to let go of the past older men and uh, men 50 years and older and look towards the future then we're moving forward and we are seeing uh moving in so for the virgos you're ending um uh you're going to be having a wonderful year there is no question about it is about love it's about money returning to you um this is going to be good love and money is always a very very good so um it is going to be a good positive alignment of energy that is going to be coming up for you virgos and this is going to be very very satisfied in this year you're going to be making changes for yourself you're going to be moving and making changes for yourself wonderful possibility wonderful ideas is going to be coming up and this is positive as we move and look at the people who were born on the 23rd of September, it's going to be a magical year. If you were trying to have kids and um, and you could not get pregnant, there was some sort of an issue, bam, 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 this year it's going to be happen. Um, if you were looking for love and nothing was coming in, bam, 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 it's going to happen in this year. If you were waiting on some sort of information because you got caught up in some sort of a situation, yeah, 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 the information is going to be coming in, all right? And this information is going to be releasing you from some worries with a corporation institution. The information is going to be coming in. So let's say that you were thinking about your contract, thinking about some sort of a work permit, document, um, government permits, um, um, that sort of a thing. It is going to be renew license renewal. It is going to be renew. It is going to be good. So congratulations. A lot of magical moments is going to be coming up for you, um, Librans, especially Librans that is born on the 23rd, because what I'm saying is that some sort of a positive alignment of energy is going to be coming out and this is going to be good. Then when we look at the, the people who were born on the 24th, you're having a wonderful, wonderful year. You're ending a cycle. The so worries is going to be over. You're going to be refining your balance. And this is going to be absolutely fabulous. Uh, worries is going to be over whatever conflicts you have. Uh, this conflict is going to be over because people are going to be finding out and uh, resolving whatever the conflict is. And you're going to be receiving a whole lot of help in order to resolve whatever conflicts there is. Worries was there, it's going to be resolved. Conflicts was there, it's going to be resolved. Inner conflicts, um, you're going to be releasing yourself of inner conflicts and realizing um, that if you ask for help, you don't have to have these problems, these conflicts, these situations coming up. So this is going to be good. Wonderful year, some sort of an issue situation is going to be over and you're going to be regaining balance and having a new wonderful year moving forward so this is just so so powerful as we look at the people who were born on the 25th wonderful positive alignment of energy um uh, 22nd 23rd 24th 25th it's like christmas the energy of the elephant some sort of a success people are finding out and seeing what was happening people are seeing a cancer for who they are a corporation institution is now really really seeing a cancer for who they are and what they have done i see um some of you virgos are going to be helped helped out of a situation realizing and seeing what was happening and transpiring in the situation and being helped out of the situation whatever the situation is or was i see like a lot of help is going to be coming into you guys so um it could be at work it could be business new business it could be at work new business new operation it is going to be okay there is a, 
um, nothing to worry about. I see a uh, transition is going to be coming in a wonderful, a positive alignment of energy is going to be coming in and this is going to be good. So um, a corporation, institution, whatever that was transpiring, you're going to be very successful. Whoever was dealing with some sort of an issue, you're going to be successfully overcoming this issue because a corporation institution is seeing what has happened and what has transpired and you're going to be resolving and moving out uh, of some sort of a problem and situation that was going on and you're going to be um you know aligning yourself moving forward in a very positive way and you're going to be receiving some sort of a help from a corporation institution because you have overcome some sort of an issue and they saw what a cancer uh, have done against some of you okay congratulations again and when we look at the people who were born on the 26th, we see the energy of the devil with some money and uh, the ace of one. Okay, the energy of the devil with some money and the ace of one. Now, whatever that was happening and transpiring with the energy of the devil, um, it's as if some of you are going to be overcharged or some of you are going to be finding out some sort of a situation with some money. So be aware of this, okay? Be aware of what is happening and what is transpiring. So um, um, let's say that um, it's some sort of a, they, someone is going to try to overcharge you and you're going to be finding out and getting to the bottom of it. And then you are going to be realizing how false and deceptive. So it's something about some sort of an invoice, but um, do not pay this invoice because you're overcharged and you are you. There's so much that you are overcharged. So be aware of this and be aligned with the energy. And this is going to be good. So whatever is happening and transpiring, just um, be very aligned with the energy and see exactly what is happening and what is transpiring. Um, be assured of. Uh, um, the issues and situation that is going to be coming up, that a certain resolution is going to be coming in. And I see wonderful, positive energy is going to be happening and transpiring. So this is good. It is an alignment of energy um, that is going to be coming up. But it is just going to be powerful as a year of uh, the lovers. And trust me, a lot of uh, um, you who were looking for love is love is going to be coming in. And this month, in this year, it is a solar year where magical alignment of energy is going to be falling into place for you, Virgos and Librans, and you cop peoples, because most of you are cop peoples, okay? So the people who were born on the 23rd, 24th, 25th, and 26th, you're cops, so you have energies of the Virgos, okay? That is what we call cops, five days out, is cops people so you have a lot of virgo energies you libra and so um sometimes people will say yeah but you're like a virgo yes uh, because you have a lot of cop energies okay you librans are run by venus the planet of love and you virgos is by mercury okay so um especially um you librans that is a cops it is so really positive because you get a lot of positive energy hurt and hair so you Librans are more grounded than the rest of the Librans who are really strong air signs. Wow, I love you guys. It, it's going to be a wonderful year for you guys. Whatever is happening and transpiring, it is going to be a powerful year. And I want to say to each and every person, thank you. Namaste. Till next time.